Hi everyone, welcome back to Dynamics Software Academy YouTube channel. Dynamics Software Academy brings you video course on Microsoft 365, Dynamics Software, Power Platform and Azure. In this video, I'm going to talk about how we can utilize sales territories in Dynamics Software customer engagement application. So sales territories basically help you configure the territories of your organization. It can be geographical territories or it can be territories based on your business domain or operation, etc. So once you have set up sales territories, you can make use of them and you can configure them for your accounts, opportunities and etc. I'll just walk you through how you can create new territories, how you can add members into your territories, how you can configure sub-territories and etc. Alright, so I have opened up my Dynamics 5 customer engagement application. If you want to configure the sales territories, I need to just select the sales app over here. Yeah, that's where it will be mostly utilized. But sales territories can be utilized to organize your members as well as you can also associate the revenue and financial with the, each of the sales territories. So you can create sales territories in order to manage your new department or your geographical region where the organization is working on. So it makes your life easier. And sales territories can be utilized within Dynamics 65 for sales, customer service, marketing, field service, and project service automation. So now to create and configure sales territories, we need to navigate to settings and then advanced settings and then go to business management setting. That's the first option. So in business management settings, you will get the option of sales territories on the left hand side. Just open that up. So here you can see the list of a lot of territories over here and you can get, you can make them as a hierarchy. So here I have created a lot of them. So this function is available to you by default, but you may not find territories created over here. So I created a couple of territories over here. Let me just open the very first one where you can see the details about a territory called Delhi. Yep. And that's a territory name. It has a parent because we can make the hierarchy India and North. So India is the parent hierarchy. So if I want to select another location over here, depends upon the, uh, what do you say? depends upon my sales organization structure, I can do it. So Delhi is coming from India North. So I'm just selecting that area. Then I can also select a manager over here. It has to be a CRM user. So I'll say Ajay Das, he is going to be the manager. Then I, I can just click save. So I am just updated an existing um, existing territory. Then I have a tab called sub territories. I can make a child to this existing territory. So I can create a new territory over here or then I add an existing one. So, okay. So I can create a new one. So I will say uh, here I'm going to select uh, Haryana. That's a place very near to Delhi. So that can be a sub territory of uh, Delhi where Delhi is changed as a parent over here. You can select again. Ajay has a manager for this also. Or I can select a different user for this territory. All right, so I'm just leaving it for this time. Then I can add a description over here. So I again, I can create another territory over here for that. So I can keep on creating like that. So if I come back to this, I can see it. And then if I go to the list of all territories, I will be able to see the new territory also I have created over here. So it's a very easy thing. And now where it will be utilized. So that is what I'm going to show you next. So we have created this new territory that you can see here. What else you can do after that is it can be linked with any parent that also we have seen. It can have more sub territories that also we have seen. And then once you go to related, you'll be able to find uh, different entities which can be connected to this one. First one, I'm trying to add some members. So we have an uh, option here to add more members. Click add members. So you can keep adding users from here. I'm going to select some users. They are going to be connected to this particular group or territory I would say uh, they will just appear here Good. so three users I have added as territory members so for this three sales people or customer service organization for that matter they can take care of the things coming to this particular territory so once you're done with the uh, territory you can go back what else you can do is you can see the hierarchy you can see here here we have an option to see the hierarchy of each of these territories so when you just create a hierarchy it will be connected with one another 
through the parent child connection so you can see the hierarchy over here you can see the hierarchy for Haryana its parent is Delhi and for Delhi the parent is India North so India North has Delhi Gujarat Punjab as the child territories you can see that a bit more better when, when I just reduce the size all right so basically you can have a hierarchy for the territories and then how to utilize these territories so for records such as uh, invoices or like account record etc you can just find the territory field and then you can just select the territory added over here so when you're trying to link an account record with your territory it will appear as a master data you can link the account to your master data and then you can create report for your territories etc for example for revenue report you can create a revenue from each of the territories or you can just take account how many new account has been created in last three quarters or two quarters in terms of the territories so those kind of report can be created when you have new territories created so you can create uh, create as well as manage territories here come to settings business management settings and sale territories so just to summarize in this video we talk about how we can manage sale territories inside Dynamics 5 customer engagement application now if you have any questions or queries you can mention that in the comment box below also we like to hear your suggestions for creating new videos for more videos of similar type you can just subscribe our channel thank you for watching have a good day